Recycling may be good for the environment, but it's becoming extremely expensive for many cities and towns across the nation, including right here in Western Mass. In fact, Springfield will soon go from paying zero to recycle to possibly paying more than a million dollars to pick up residents' bottles, cans, paper, and plastic. Beth Ward digging deeper for us into this issue and getting answers from the head of the city's DPW. And Beth, how does the city plan to pay for all the recycling costs. Yeah, well, Springfield and a whole lot of other cities and towns across Western Mass, that is the $1 million question, or should I say $1.1 million to be exact question for Springfield. There's a lot of buzz among residents on the street and in online forums about the possibility of having to pay higher trash and recycling fees. So we sat down with Chris Signoli, he's DPW's uh, director for Springfield, to get some answers. We found out that this is not just a Springfield issue, but one facing many cities and towns all across the U.S. and, as we said, right here in Western Mass. So this is what take, gets them the most money. Yes. Springfield DPW Director Chris Signoli breaks down the recycling numbers, and they aren't what they used to be. What we call AMV, the average market value. Signoli tells Western Mass News no so-called recyclable is valued as it once was. In fact, some are simply no longer being recycled, Period. Glass and paper and contaminated paper, it's just you, you're actually having to, vendors are now having to pay to get rid of that sort of stuff versus truly recycling it, which makes no sense when you think about glass. It would be the first thing you would think that would be a logical thing for recycling. Springfield is what's called a single stream community, meaning residents put all recyclables, glass, paper, plastic, into one bin. Easier for residents, but Signoli says turns out it is becoming much more expensive. Springfield is a single stream community and the price for disposal of recycling under that contract is just a hair under $150 a ton to get rid of recycling and for context that's we pay $75 to get rid of trash so getting rid of recycling now is double what it costs to get rid of uh, recycling material over trash. Why? There's no really there's the simple thing is there's no international market for recycling material. Signoli tells Western Mass News right now Springfield generates about 7,000 tons of recycling each year. Under the current contract, it's free, but that contract with Waste Management and the Department of Environmental Protection expires June 30th. If the city renews, he said it will cost $1.1 million for the year starting July 1st to recycle. And when you look at all the communities in Western Mass and you add it up, this is a six, seven million dollar issue for all the communities in Western Mass put together. So everybody's feeling the same amount of pain at this point. Right now, Signoli says the city is looking at other, more economical contractors. But bottom line, every community, he says, will have to pay to recycle moving forward. How will they pay? The current Springfield trash fee for residents is $90 per year. Our goal is never to increase the trash fee. We're going to look under every rock to figure out the best financial situation for, for the city. Now, Signoli says because of the increasing costs, many communities across the country are getting rid of their recycling programs altogether. However, he says in addition to the benefits for the environment, Massachusetts law mandates that all items deemed recyclable, whether they actually are or not, go into a separate bin separate from the trash. In the studio, Beth Ward, Western Mass News.